Hey, was that the ears, bro? Huh? There's blood on the ears. <laughs> Hey guys, it's Sheldon Edwards here, HD Cuts. Normally I cut the football players here, but today we're going to cub them to meet my friend Tommy Abraham. Let's go! You couldn't get to the barber shop, so we'll bring the barber shop to you. What do you think, bro? I like it. I like it. Obviously, with everything going on right now, it's hard for everyone to go to a barber shop, and I need one soon as well. How important do you think a fresh haircut is to footballers, man? It's important to feel good, and a haircut always makes you feel good, you know? It gives you that extra confidence when you go out there on the pitch. Yeah? Who do you think I got the best year cut? I'll say myself. <laughs> yeah. I have a fresh trim and I'm looking all, yeah, yeah. I'll say myself. Who else do you cut? Well, inside the Chelsea team, Antonio Rudiger. Outside now, we talk the likes of Raheem Sterling. Overseas, Jaden Sancho. Bro, the list goes on and on, bro. Okay, bro, we're gonna do some cutting. I'm scared. And we're gonna see if you can be an HD. <laughs> So let me see what you think about what we got. Oh. <laughs> oh. <laughs> That's about six months into quarantine. That's what we're going into right now. How would you start this haircut then? First of all, I'll start it off by, I don't know. I don't know. Tell you what I want you to do, yeah? So basically you're just trying to remove a bit of the excess here on the side. Easy, man. This is easy. Yeah? Watch the ears, bro. Watch the ears. Let's go for the clippers now, yeah? Well done, son. Woo! Can I come and walk at the shop? <laughs> if football don't work out, man, we can connect for sure. <laughs> hey, was that the ears, bro? Huh? Was that the ears? Bro, you don't want the clients to come back soon, bro. I want mine to be better than yours, that's why. What? Wait, he's in competition with me. Oh my gosh. All right, bro. I think you're doing okay, you know, yeah? But I think we got an alternative. I'm pretty sure this person loves his haircut. So let's see what Ooh. you can do with this, bro. Let's go. <laughs> okay, okay, okay. I can have fun with this one. You reckon you got this one, bro? I'll start off with the scissors. You know what to do? Mm -hmm. Okay, all right. Show me what to do, bro. This bottom bit is too long. Careful, you know. Don't go near to the beard just like that, bro. Ollie loves his beard, bro. Oh, no. I know he loves his beard. Remember, customer service. Take time. Take time with the client. This guy's got so much hair, man. If I lose this haircut battle off to a football player, I'm not cutting here for the rest of the week. <laughs> That's more like an Ollie beard, bro. No, mine is more like an Ollie beard. <laughs> bro, what's going on in the back of the head there, man? Don't worry, bro. I ain't worrying, bro. Bro, that's a different kind of hair on the top there, though. But that looks like a coconut, bro. Hey, let me explain my trim. He likes his long hair, so I've left the top long. But his beard was, you know, he couldn't eat with it. He would have had pasta and everything in his beard. <laughs> because it's getting cold, I didn't want to get so to You left some to warm up the back of his neck. I see exactly. there's a bit of, see? There's a lot of excess part on the back Two there. Two barbers think alike. Uh, oh, hey! Oh my gosh. You're going to massage it into his head. <laughs> Bro, you look like he's in the shower. Oh my gosh. I've never seen Hollywood a mohawk. Out of 10? To be nice, I would give him one. I'm, oh, trying, I'm trying to be no nice, bro. No way. <laughs> if he came into the changing room with this trim, I would shake his hand. No banter if he came in the changing room with this. I would laugh. But his beard is amazing. The trim's so good, yeah? I'm going to take a picture and send it to my team WhatsApp group. Oh, boy. 